Hi everyone, my name is Mayank and welcome back to my YouTube channel. On this channel I talk about the books that I read, my life and some productivity related content. So if you are interested in such content, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also hit the bell icon so that you never miss another video from my side. Having heard so much about uh, Neil Gaiman, I always wanted to read him. But I never really got a chance to read any book by him. Uh, this year I actually decided to start reading Neil Gaiman books and I started off with a non-fiction book written by Neil Gaiman. The name of the book is Art Matters. So in this video I'll be doing a review of the book and uh, putting out my thoughts on the book. So stay tuned for the video. I think if you want to start reading Neil Gaiman books, Art Matters is a perfect book to start because it's short, it's around 120 pages, so it will be a quick read for you. Also, the book has a very easy language and also it is a non-fiction book, so it will not take much time for you to get into the book and uh, complete it. So, you can start off with this book. The book talks about all forms of art, uh, so whether it is uh, books or movies or comics or any such stuff which is considered as art. Uh, when the book begins, uh, Neil Gaiman states a fact that there is a high correlation between the people who do not read and prisoners in the world, which is a fact that may hit you. Uh, it is kind of a fact which can also let you to understand that it is important to read, it is important to be aware of our world, of our surroundings, so that we can make better decisions uh, because this is the world that we live in. And if we read more about it, we can make better decisions. One of the most important points that uh, Neil Gaiman touches in this book and which I also enjoyed the most is the point of reading fiction. Uh, many people in the world feel that it is not uh, good to read fiction, it is uh, not useful to read fiction because you're not going to get any kind of uh, facts out of it. Fiction is something which is not true. So even if you read it, you are not able to apply it in your real life. So many people feel that it is not useful to read fiction books. But Neil Gaiman thinks otherwise. He states some points which proves that reading fiction can actually help you in your life. So for this, uh, to prove this point, he makes two, uh, he gives two reasons. The first reason he gives is that when you read fiction, you become attached with the protagonist. You start going wherever the protagonist is going. You start thinking whatever the protagonist is thinking. So it really helps you build your mindset. You understand uh, what the protagonist is going through. So even if in real life you are faced with a situation, you can understand what the other person is going through. So it will help you to interact uh, in your personal life in a better manner because you will be able to understand communications in a better way. The second point and an important point which uh, Neil mentions, uh, which is in favor of reading fiction, is empathy. So he mentions that when you read fiction books, you uh, are empathetic to the protagonist of the book. Your empathy builds up. You start to um, think in the minds of the protagonist to land in his shoes. And uh, whenever the protagonist is in some kind of trouble, you root for him. Whenever the protagonist comes out of a difficult situation, you also see heave a sigh of relief along with the protagonist. So basically you are feeling each and every feeling that the protagonist is going through and that really helps you to build empathy. So in case you don't know what empathy is, it is a slightly deeper version of sympathy. So when you are actually feeling what the other person is feeling, that is when you are empathetic. So if a person is going through a difficult time in his life, you are able to relate to that person so much that you feel the exact same feelings. You also feel that you are going through a difficult time in your life. So you can actually help that other person uh, through this difficult time. That is something which fiction also helps build. And in the end, uh, Neil also touches on another important aspect of modern day uh, fiction, which is the battle between the different formats of reading. Today we have mainly three formats of uh, reading books. We can read books through hard copies, we can read books through ebooks, we can also read them through audiobooks. So he also touches upon that fact. But he mentions that it does not matter which form you use to read books. Until and unless you are consuming uh, good art, good form of art, you should continue to uh, read books. So if I have to summarize the book in uh, one sentence which Neil also mentions in the end of the book, it would be make good art. 
So what Neil uh, means by this thing is that art is something which can help us in, in our life in so many different situations. So we should continue to consume art in its different forms and we should also try to create art if possible. So that is the kind of a summary of a book if you want in three words. Uh, overall, if I have to say, I really enjoyed reading the book. It was a great experience uh, because I was also sometimes going through uh, this question in my mind, whether it is um, okay to read fiction, whether I should only read non-fiction books. But this book kind of uh, makes you believe in that uh, fiction is also a good form of art. You should continue to read fiction. So if you're looking to start off reading with uh, Neil Gaiman books, this is a good start because this is a very easy read, very quick read and also it is in uh, also it is a very short one it is in very simple language uh, so you can definitely start with this one I thoroughly enjoyed the book and I would suggest it to everyone so if you enjoyed the video do not forget to uh, like the video subscribe to my channel and also press the bell icon so that you don't miss an update from my side my name is Mayank and I will see you soon thank you for watching